Hi guys, so it's my first, second actually, second day in Luxembourg and I am already sick, so like when I was living I was like uh, why should I take uh, drops for the cough or handkerchiefs hand 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 and now I understand why, because my nose is full and my throat is slightly sore so um, it's really fun to be sick in a foreign country that you don't know your way around um, the house is nice it, you can see that it's quite old but you know the rooms are okay I am in a temporary room now and I will move to my actual room today but first I need to get to the pharmacy and to just try to get on the bus and get off at my, the place of my work I just want to practice it so I'm not really confused and stressed on Monday it's Friday now <laughs> girls are nice the housemaid I will have once well, she's from Malta and she's really bubbly and cheerful she's really nice the landlords are really nice very talkative and they speak English which is great I am a little nervous to go to the pharmacy because I was told that if you go to like an ordinary shop or you should talk French to them learning the health vocabulary in French was never my hobby like I just didn't learn all the vocabulary so now I feel quite sorry because I had to actually google how to say no spray le spray pour le nez so I will take you for a quick uh, tour around the house I will show you what I cook today I don't really feel like cooking I don't really even feel like eating anything so I just bought the most essential things to just put something together I hope to, it to be enough for me until the, the end of the weekend and then I will probably cook something better the next week once, once I go to work already Please ignore how shitty I look because I'm sick. I was traveling for 17 hours yesterday and it's so hard to speak for me. So sorry for how I look. Let's go for a tour. Next to my room is a small bathroom with a shower curtain. It's just, I use it for showers, obviously. <laughs> then these are other girls' rooms. This is the Czech girl that will come on Sunday and this is the Maltese girl, she's really nice. Another bathroom. This one is slightly bigger, but I don't intend to use this one. This is the living room, which is quite big. We have a new TV, dining table. Some books over there that I checked, but I don't really like the titles. The view from the living room. Actually, the rose is over there, the land landlady told me. They were planted when her, her parents celebrated their 50th anniversary together. And ironing board with iron that I don't intend to use because, as you may know, because you should know that my style is to get really unironed. It's not my style to iron. This is the welcome area and this is the kitchen. I call this the shelves of shame because it's all the things that the previous train is left here. This gives me headaches because I can't cook on electrical cookers. And this is another shelf. This is my cupboard. It's pretty empty right now. I just have chia seeds I brought from home, oats, organic, some chopped tomatoes, ratatouille. This is like an emergency case if I have really nothing to eat. Then some spices, lentils, because I want to make a lentil soup. Uh, basmati rice that I will use today and olive oil. Red grapes, it's soy sauce. Chamomile tea for my nose, <laughs> uh, garlic, uh, bananas, and I also bought potatoes, but as I was told and as I found out, they have really bad potatoes, like they look nice, but in the inside they are all rotten and not really good and they are quite expensive. For so this is my lovely breakfast consisting of oats, chia seeds, banana, grapes and water. 
And this is our fridge. Two portions of uh, broccoli soup. This is not mine. <laughs> I bought this mix for wok. So I will use this one with soy sauce and basmati rice today when I come back home. And this is tabouleh. Tabouleh oriental with, uh, I don't know what. <laughs> But it looks really nice and I used to eat this when I used to live in Paris so uh, I know that I will like it and it's just basically couscous with some veggies and with raisins or cranberries or sometimes they put mint in it. It will be just like emergency dinner or lunch when I don't really have time to eat something. So this is my lunch with the stir-fried veggies that I bought, already pre-cut. Basmati rice with soy sauce. This is the chamomile tea. I bought um, the cup because I like to have my own cups to drink from. And this is something really cool. It's like a bento box for uh, lunch. And it was like 6 euro. And it's really leak proof. And you can divide the food with this. So I will pack the rest of my lunch there because that should be enough for tomorrow. This is my room. A new yoga mat that I bought from Fairy Light under the window. And the beautiful view into the garden on the roses. So that's it. And it's pretty small, but I like it. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cozy. I like it. <laughs>